what is the Miyawaki method of afforestation? The Miyawaki method of forestation was pioneered by a Japanese botanist named Akira Miyawaki. We can use this method to grow an urban forest within a short span of 20 to 30 years. Note that a conventional forest takes 200 to 300 years to grow naturally. In this method, various native species of plants are planted close to each other so that the plants receive sunlight only from the top and grow upwards instead of sideways. As a result, the plantation becomes 30 times denser, grows 10 times faster and becomes maintenance free after a span of 3 years. Use this stepwise guide to create an urban forest with the Miyawaki method. The selected site should have a minimum size of 4 by 3 meters and the plant should receive sunlight for at least 8 hours each day. Step 1 is soil preparation. A combination of perforators, water retainers, fertilizers and microorganisms should be mixed with the existing soil. The perforator materials include biomass, rice husk, wheat husk, corn husk or chipped brown nut shells that allow the plant roots to grow quickly. The water retainers include copepeat or sugarcane stalk which allows the soil to retain more moisture and water than the soil's natural water retention capacity. Opt for organic fertilizers like manure or wormy compost to nourish the soil. Step 2. Purchase native species of plants. Make a list of all the native species of plants and divide them into evergreen, deciduous and perennial plants respectively. All the native trees of any region can be classified into four layers. Choose shrubs which can grow up to 6 feet for the first layer, trees which grow up to 25 feet for the second layer, trees which grow up to 40 feet for the third layer, and canopy trees which grow above 40 feet for the fourth layer. Buy saplings which have a height ranging between 24 to 32 inches from the nursery. Include maximum native species of plants for biodiversity. Step 3. Design the forest. Arrange the dense plantation of the native species of plants so that they grow into different layers. All the species of plants should be arranged in a staggered manner and similar species of plants should not be planted together. Step 4. Method of plantation. On an average, 3 to 5 saplings should be planted within an area of 1 square meter. Do not follow a repetitive pattern while planting the saplings. After the saplings are planted, a thick layer of mulch should be evenly laid on the soil. It helps in insulating the soil and prevents water from evaporating. Step 5. Tie the plants to a stick. The plants should be tied to support sticks with a jute string to prevent them from stooping or bending in the initial months of plantation. Step 6. Water and monitor the plantation. The forest should be watered at least once a day. Make sure that the forest is free from weeds for the first two years. Do not use any chemicals like pesticides or inorganic fertilizers. Monitor the forest every two months to check the growth of all the plants. Do not cut or prune the forest.